What's up guys, Mark here from VIP Shop Management. Uh, I want to address two issues. Uh, number one is why VIP Shop Management? Why, how come we don't advertise like our competitors like ShopMonkey, uh, Shopware, Techmetric and all these? Why, how come we don't advertise? Another subject I want to talk about is uh, there's a there's a website it's called uh, uh, Software Advice. Uh, we're going to look into that too. I'm going to talk about why we're not even on that software advice. Well, first of all, we all know advertising costs so much money. And to advertise, you got to raise the prices on our customers. And that's not what I'm interested in. We're not interested in raising the prices. Our prices is $55 a month uh, for local database and $99 a month for cloud and uh, we're not we have zero intention of, of raising the prices anytime soon um, uh, and I like those numbers five five and nine nine so when I chose them I really like them uh, it, it looks it, it's we are cheaper than any, anyone else by a lot man if you're paying three hundred fifty dollars um, that's a lot of money, man. Uh, 350 you do it the first month and the second month and the third month you're hurting. And that's the problem, man, is these small shops go sign up for uh, for ShopMonkey or TechMetric. And, and the problem is, you know, the way TechMetric and ShopMonkey and Shop were trying to get you is they tell you, hey, hey sign up for the $99.00. But the problem is that in the $99, you don't get anything. You don't get, I, I, I was talking to somebody recently and he says, he says that I just needed inventory. And uh, they put, a shop monkey put the inventory in the second where you have to pay $225. And he was like, I couldn't believe it. I have to pay $125 uh, for extra for inventory. I was like, welcome to the, welcome to the new world, man. That's what's going on out there. The VIP shop management is the only authentic uh, shop management system that does not rely on advertisement. We don't advertise. Uh, I think I, I'm the type of guy who I think when you advertise, it's like flushing money in the toilet. And I understand it has its own moment. I'm not stupid. But at the same time, I understand like there's people don't want to see the advertisement, whether you're on Facebook, you scroll and it pops in right there. Let, let me show you right here. If I search for, let's, let's go on Google, let's search for our repair shop management. And look, our repair shop management, whoever pays money, Google is willing to put them up front. Baymaster, uh, pro, pro, pro actors, whatever, Arulip, I don't know, who, they, they just put them out there. They just put them out there. Why? Because they're paying money. Just like, man, when you go on the watch, I'm trying to watch the game. I always talk about that. And uh, State Farm pops on every three seconds. I was like, no wonder why State Farm is so expensive as a shot, as an insurance. Because they're paying so much money to the TV and these actors to pop in and talk about it. Yeah, no, no. You got to get, you got to get <laughs> State Farm. And the rest are not even better. So that's the problem. When you, when you want to advertise... You've got to raise the money. There's there's a budget for advertisement. Actually, one of the biggest budget out there in any shop management softwares is advertisement because it brings customers. But VIP shop management doesn't really need advertisement. Why is that? Because we did really good when we were selling it as one-time payment before. We have 1,400 shops across the country in Canada that, that uses VIP shop management on a daily basis. This is our advertisement. It's the word of mouth. So when you see a shop management, when, she, when you see a shop that using VIP shop management, this shop is happy and don't want anything to do with shop monkey and shop key and, and tech metric and all that stuff. Why? Because this shop is not willing to spend five to six thousand dollars to just to create an invoice. And I, I always say, man, it's an estimate, convert to an invoice, cash me out. Don't make it more than where it is. Some people get this whole thing. I need it to be on my phone. I need it to use it on my Android. I, need... I have one question. What is your revenue? And if your revenue under $1 million and you tell me you need to use it on your phone and you need to do this, then you're doing something wrong. But it's okay to make a mistake. What's not okay is to stay where you at. Spend six thousand dollars on shop management software because you need inventory, like the other guy told me. Anyway, let's talk about 
So, like I said, you know, even Google, they, they sold that a long time ago. They used to put advertisement on the side and then you can search whatever you want, but they couldn't hold it. That's why I don't trust Google because they can be they can sell you out just like that and they sold out. Now look, I just I just searched and now I'm stuck with something called ad, 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 ad. The question is, when I searched for that, I, sometimes I search for VIP shop management. I am specifically said VIP shop management, and it gives me five ads sometimes, sometimes seven ads to, to go to my website. Why? They sold out a long time ago. They want whoever pays the more, don't care about what you think. They don't care. Google don't care about what you think, what you're looking for. They care about what they want to sell you. Man, I understand this whole world is about selling, but don't force people to buy your product. I never force anybody. When somebody calls me, he says, Mark, I'm interested in your product. And uh, we sit and talk and I answer this question. And the one thing I usually say, I don't know if we, I spoke to you, I'm sure you heard that, you heard me saying that. He said, I really cannot make you choose VIP shop management. You gotta watch the videos, and you gotta you gotta like it first. Once you like it, then you know you can spend fifty five dollars or ninety nine dollars to put it to the test. So you gotta like it first, then put it to the, to the test to see if it meets if it meets your needs. Man, VIP shop management has the fastest flow ever. From creating an estimate, quick buttons, converting to an, converting to an invoice, checking it out, just like that. All right, the second thing I want to talk about is, um, uh, let me see if I can find this best. It's called best software. I get this question a lot, all the time. Why aren't you on, on this? Let me see. Ads, look, one, two, three, four. It's like, it's like uh, Google knows who's the best, right? It's, it knows by how much how much uh, auto leap is paying them right now if you click on i don't want to click on that but if i click on this they'll charge you five bucks instantly just like that um so let's go back to software advice i think that's the one i believe so just to make sure software advice and yeah, so software advice, how come are we not in this list? I get this a lot. Well, for me to be on this list is I got to join software advice and I, they, they got to charge me money. So basically the way it works is they got to make money every time I bring you in. And that's what things between me and VIP shop management doesn't fit in. I just, I don't, I like authenticity. I like it when, when somebody really want to come to VIP shop management, not just by by coming to so, like all these RO Leap, Shop Monkey, Tech Metric, RO Fluent, Max Tracks, all of them pay the software to post this, to put their stuff on it. All of them. And I'm like, Mark, so, so what? If all of them are paying, why don't you join? Just because everybody's doing one thing, that doesn't mean VIP shop management will do the same thing. We're not interested. We're not interested because this is anytime you're collecting money to give an advice, your authenticity has went through the toilet. Basically, you flush the authenticity because I don't believe you anymore. I don't, where is it? Where is v, okay, so where is VIP shop management? It doesn't exist. Why is it? I thought you, you are given the best advice for software, but you're not. You're given the best advice who's willing to pay for it. And that's why you got to be smarter than that. So anyway, in the end, what you need to do is just watch the videos. Let's go to YouTube and search. Thank God they, there's no ads here. Otherwise, probably, well, let's see. Maybe I'm sure there is that. I, I apologize. I take it back. I just searched for VIP shop management, right? Shop management software easy to use. Shopware. <laughs> I specifically said VIP shop management. Try Identifix. Here we go. <laughs> anyway, here's VIP shop management. We have 
screen capture videos, man, you can watch it. And the first thing that you need to look for, man, is I know we make a lot of videos, I understand that, but there's a search right there, so you can search our videos right here. Um, if you wanted to sit down and relax and see how VIP shop management, just look for demo, just search demo right here, demo. I, like I said, I know it's a small search, but you know, because um, again, YouTube, uh, you searching inside this doesn't make YouTube money. So <laughs> they want you to search up top so they can make money. Man, like I'm really smart enough to understand how the whole system work. But this is what I'm talking about selling out. Like I try my best no matter what not to sell out. I think I've done an amazing job for the past uh, three years that VIP shop management has been in business. And don't think that I don't get requests all the time to sell out. I just, the way I do business is I think about it first. And I say, would I, would I be okay with that? And if the answer is yes, then I go partner with this company. And if the answer is no, then I don't partner with this company. And I promise you, most of the time is no, more than yes. That's it. So yeah, just search demo in our tiny search right there. <laughs> search demo, and you're gonna see like, the, I think that's our latest demo right here. Um, uh, let's just check it out. My opens in a few hours, she, I, I don't even get paid for that ad, but it's okay. So, this is our latest demo. All our, all more, okay, so most of our videos are 4K now, so you can really see the details. If you have a 4K monitor, if you have 1080 monitor, then you should see, be, you should be able to see it too, but watch it. And at least VIP shop management is not influenced by anyone else. Um, we don't want to pay for advertisement. I'm not interested. I feel like the moment we start advertisement, we lose something precious. Something that I don't like. I don't like it when, when I'm watching the game. And I get it, I get it, but I don't like it when they put it in your throat. Hey, buy this printer. Shaquille, Shaquille O'Neal, man, he keep advertisement for printer, Buick. I can keep up. And, and here's how I think. Every time I see Shaquille O'Neal, and no offense, I love him as a basketball player. But every time I see him advertising something, I know, like, okay, thank God. Thank you, Shaq, for letting me know that whatever you're doing is garbage. That that printer is garbage. That That insurance is garbage. Why? Because any company that is willing to spend, give you that much money just to force it on down our throat to buy it is trash. That's it. Anyway, I appreciate you guys. Until next time, thanks for watching.